1982, when I when I came to Upper Iowa, I was in need of a mentor, and uh, when I met Bill, uh, he took me under my took me under his wing right away. One of the signs of a good coach is that uh, that coach is still has um, a role in the player's life 20 years down the road, and um, Coach Prohaska has had a role in my life, you know, every day, every year. Bill Prohaska's impact on Upper Iowa University is something that can hardly be put into words. A true Peacock himself, he graduated from UIU in 1963 and celebrated his 50th reunion this year. Coach Pro did just about everything he could possibly do at Upper Iowa as basketball and baseball head coach, along with men's and women's golf head coach. He also served as athletic director, associate professor, and the divisional chair of education at different times in his career. Over the course of his 31 years of work on campus, he crossed paths with thousands of individuals. So I just got a little tidbit of information for you. You know, he's probably the only guy I know that can reference six different people in one sentence. <laughs> I, I have a couple of good close friends that I grew, we grew up together and played some baseball together at Upper Iowa who didn't stay the full four years, but they were with Coach Prohaska for probably a season. and. Uh, I think you ask about him every time I see him. I don't think about Upper Iowa without my thoughts going back to Coach Bro immediately. You know, and, and I played for other coaches that were here, but I mean, he was a, had a genuine love and still does have that love for Upper Iowa. And it, it came out every single day you spoke to him. And, you know, even the, the um, young men and women that didn't play for him um, could see that love come through. You know, he's, he's like a second dad. I can always count on him. I know wherever I'm at, um, if I ever needed anything, all I'd have to do is call. And that's the relationship that, that he has not only with me, but a thousand other guys um, that he was able to impact their life. Being able to impact and connect with so many people is a big part of Pro's legacy at Upper Iowa. No matter whether a person was on one of his teams, another team, or a general student on campus, there was a good chance they met Pro. He always made sure to stress the importance and history of Upper Iowa to anyone he was in contact with. He helped to carry on numerous traditions on campus and was instrumental in continuing to honor Doc's boys at homecoming every year. A Hall of Fame inductee himself, Pro helped to establish the Hall of Fame in 1980, still currently serves as the chair, and has met 171 of the 176 members in the Hall of Fame. His passion for the history at Upper Iowa is evident by anyone that has ever spoken to him, and it has left the Prohaska name in elite Peacock Company. To me, you know, there's Doc Dorman, and, and then there's Bill Prohaska, and um, you know, thanks to Bill Prohaska, I know my Upper Iowa history. I have a lot of respect for all the guys that came before me, and there are a lot of good guys, you know, the Eyeshides, all those guys that I know, and I know how much they gave. Um, because of Coach Pro. When I look back and I see the legacy of Coach Prohaska, it will be Coach Prohaska slash Upper Iowa or Upper Iowa slash Coach Prohaska. I, I think they're one and the same. Through it all, Pro was always a coach. And as a coach, he helped to mold numerous young men and women into coaches themselves that went on to great careers. I remember coming in talking to Coach Pro about um, the two jobs that I had settled on. And um, there was a third job that I had not been offered yet. And, and coach said, give me a day, um, just give me a day. And I said, you know, what do you mean by that? Don't sign any contracts, give me a day. Um, and the long story short, his day was making a phone call to Wapsie Valley. Um, and that phone call led into my first interview, led into my second interview. And 30 years later, I'm still at Wapsie Valley. So, you know, without Coach Pro, uh, who knows where I'd be now. But uh, my job, my you know, my coaching career would never be the same without having Coach Pro. And because of Coach Pro, I was able to have a degree where I could go out and coach. And if it wasn't for Bill, and, and honestly, his wife Jan pushing me a lot, um, you know, during my early years at, at Upper Iowa, you know, that might not have happened. And, um, you know, I thank Bill a lot for, for the inspiration, for constantly, um, you know, pushing me to do well in the classroom and that, um, you know, he was he was always big on trying to get guys to go into coaching and so that they could give back and give back um, you know, to kids and the education. And he talked about it a lot, not just with me, but with a lot of guys. And that's why I think there are so many great coaches out there from Upper Iowa. To ensure future generations of coaches will feel the impact of Coach Pro, Upper Iowa has established an endowed scholarship in honor of Bill Prohaska. 
This scholarship will be awarded to future students that choose a career path of coaching or education, just as Pro did. Coach Pro's impact on Upper Iowa will never be forgotten. And now his legacy will forever inspire the lives of future coaches, just as he did for so many years. Just an all-around great guy. Bleeds, bleeds uh, peacock blue, that's for sure. You know, and thank you for the, the, the time that you've put in, um, for um, the ability to show us how to love a university, you know, and love your job and love what you were doing. Um, you know, that has had a direct impact on not only myself, but many of the people that um, have been associated with Coach Pro and the fact that he taught us that, you know, going to work is one thing, but having a love for what you do is another. And I, I think I carry that with me every single day. He talked about giving back and what you could do to help others. And, you know, just a great man, great person. And I, I love Coach Pro.